Sorry, guys. They ran out again. Oh. Something's got to be done. Oh, I love oh. Hey! Oh, you the man. You the man. What the hell, man? Oh. That's half our problem right there. Starburns works the fryer and skims fingers. No way. He gives them to people just so they'll act like he isn't Starburns. Well, I may not eat meat, but I am not going to eat that injustice. Let's complain. Yeah. If we complain, he gets a warning and learns to be sneakier. I say we knock him out of the kitchen and replace him with one of our own all in one move. Then we're the ones with the chicken. It's like a mafia movie. As far back as I can remember, I always wanted to be in a mafia movie. Cool. That's exactly what it's like, Abed. And you get the most important job. You're going to be fry cook. We may be watching different mafia movies. You worked in your dad's restaurant, right? Well, you'll apply for the job after we get Starburns fired. I don't know about that. I don't know. I think he really relies on that income. Yeah. Every day, you flock here like sheep and wait in line for a broken promise from a dirty system. Back in those days, Jeff Winger was the guy that made things happen. He always knew what to say, and he always knew when to slap the table. You want to be sheep? Keep flocking. You want to be wolves? Form a pack. And that was it. It was that simple. At that moment, we stopped being a family and started being a family in italics. Britta got cozy with Starburns. He lowered his guard. He was gone. I mean, the way Jeff saw it, by not respecting us, Starburns had basically brought it on himself. And when his job opened up, we did what we had to do to keep the list of applicants to a minimum. I had worked in my dad's falafel restaurant, so I had a pretty impressive resume. It's very impressive. Especially your reference. It's a skip call right now. But we weren't taking any chances. The fix was in. Trump Tower, this is Donald. Well, we could deep fry the hell out of chicken, I could tell you that. Troy even applied for the same job and gave the world's worst interview, just to make me look better. And that was that. Give me some more time in